page. Hey, I think we're good. Okay, let's see. I hear it. Yep. Yep, my phone actually behaved today. Huzzah. Got it. Alrighty, guys. Hello again, and welcome back to the Illegally Cited Mixer stream. I'm so confused at what day it is, because today is... I know it's Sunday, but it's so weird, because I worked on Saturday, and it's just weird. But uh, we are back for another stream, a little uh, pre-Super Bowl kickoff, as we're uh, recording today. And a little game that I covered on stream earlier last year. We're going to play again because the final thing is out. It is not a shooter. It is instead a kind of a action-y, puzzle-y game called Hyperdot. Got Riley over there on the other mic. Hello! And yeah, we are going to play some Hyperdot via the PC. It is also on Xbox, from what I remember. And uh, this is a very simple game in concept, but can get rather challenging rather quickly. You are this little pixel or dot, and we basically, you are trying to... Whoa, that's kind of loud. Um, you're in these little arenas, and... It's basically this pacifist game of everything is coming at you and moving around, and you have to just survive. Press return to begin. Well, I'm going to hit A because I'm going to use the Xbox One controller. I have not played the final version of this at all. I did pop in here for about 30 seconds earlier just to make sure the game ran, and I did switch because I happen to know via their Twitter feed. That they included a dark mode. Yay, we got dark mode. And look at this menu. I'm liking this, because we got nice dark background now. We've got really nice large text. God, that's a nice thing to see. <laughs> Single player, multiplayer, level editor. That's a pretty cool idea. Settings, credits, statistics, and quit. Let's go under settings really fast, and I will just show you, I probably will do a spotlight for this at some point too, if somebody wants a shorter version of this, because we're just going to play some. We have audio, video, and accessibility. Let's pop into accessibility and see what we have. So we have high contrast, which apparently is on. We have color, and of course we have dark mode. I'll show you what light mode, oh yeah, boy. I, I much, much prefer dark, because that's a lot of white. So we're going to go back to the dark side here. And we've got colorblind. We can turn that on. Screen shake. We can turn that off if we choose. And animated backgrounds. Now this may or may not, depending on how animated they are or how distracting they are, this may or may not be something that I want to disable. I'm going to keep it on though. And there you go. Uh, we have a few other options. So we've got like a vibration. Oh, Toby eye tracking. There you go. So if you have a mobility impairment or just want to control it with the Toby eye tracking system, you can do that as well. I do not have that hardware. Vibration, we can turn that on and off. HUD, we can move where the HUD is. And I'm going to keep it in the center because that seems like a pretty good idea. And privacy. So that's about all we got. Let's play this thing. Single player. All right, we have campaign, custom level, and free play. Hmm, I'm gonna have to check out free play just to see what kind of things we got here. All right, so setup. All right, select, uh, let's see, well, oh, okay, so we're gonna choose the color of our dot. Yeah, let's be this bright. That should stand out quite nicely. It's kind of blue color. Okay, we have, okay, non-stop, collect eight tokens, uh, now I wonder, oh, did it save when I had the early access version? Glide, I wonder, so A, B, C, D, oh, okay, so we have A, B, in a way, I kind of wanted to start at the beginning just to 
you know, I think that would be a good thing because yeah. we can. Yeah. We have all through D unlocked, and then there are three more that have padlocks on them. So we have our different levels here. The first one, 001 beginning. And does it say survival, 12 seconds? Yeah, like I said, the UI in this is just really clean. Uh, I like it a lot. I like it a lot. All right, survival, let's do this. Oh, God, hi. I wasn't really kind of paying attention. I was just sort of... So we got to survive here. Got our red dots that we're dodging. All right, complete. Not too shabby. First try, completed. Beginning. Yep. All right, status. And what else do we have? We have next level. Restart with Y and back with B. Let's go. Okay. Um, easing in. All right. Survival. Oh, okay. I wasn't paying too much attention there. Okay, I see what we gotta do. I see what you want me to do. Yep, you want me to fail. Okay. Go like that. And, wow. <laughs> okay. Yep, easing in. Okay, I think if I stay pretty much right here, nothing can hit me. There we go. So, a little rough start there, but we got this. Abstract. Alright, survival. So, it's just going to be some random... Oh, okay. Random little wavy things. Yeah, this is really nice and easy to see with this high contrast mode like this. I like this a lot. Some nice, calming, catchy music. Okay, eight line, eight line. Oh, okay, fifteen seconds. Okay, fifteen seconds. Okay, we got that. Hello. I'm gonna move away from you. So, like I said, you can play with pretty much any controller you want. You can play with the keyboard, mouse, joystick, and I totally whiffed that right at the end. That was bad. Oh. Hey, Carl, what's up, my man? Alright, we got Carl in there. Cool. Hey, dude. How's it going? We're playing a little Hyperdot here. I knew just by his username who it was. Ah, uh, fair enough. Alright, level complete. Level four. Alright, 16 seconds. Targeted. Alright, so they're gonna presumably track me or something. So we're gonna move around. <laughs> he says rolling on the floor laughing because I knew who it was. Ah. Uh, why? What is his name? Huh? Why? What's his name? His name's Kane. Oh, okay. That's his username. Okay. Alright, that got that one done. Level 6. 15 seconds. Warmed up. Oh boy. Okay, well that means we're going to throw more crap in our way, so... Stuff is about to get real. And I totally whiffed that. My bad. And this was one of the first games I ever chat moderated out of uh, here. That actually got into... Yep. Yapping in the background for you. Hello. Whoa, that one, he almost nicked me there. Hello, get away from me. There we go. The first ever stream I did was Life is Strange too but I didn't talk much. Mm -hmm. Then when we did the demo for this... For Homing, them, oh boy. When they wanted people to basically test it for accessibility, they wanted streamers to do it. He volunteered, ah, so then I just away from me. was in the background talking and reading him the chat. And then basically got there we go. asked to keep going, so that's why I did. Mm-hmm. Alrighty, and now we've got, okay, 12 seconds. Alright, weaving through. Okay. I like to read the tips because that kind of tells you roughly what you might be in for, for better or for worse. Yeah. <laughs> now, I'm not sure, I don't know what this... Oh, I wonder if that's just telling you where your thing is. I don't think it pushes anything back. Let's find out. Nope, it does not. It has no effect 
on the enemy oh god enemy triangles in this case oh my god okay yeah they're they're after you they're not uh, they're not messing around they are out for blood <laughs> These triangles have some sort of beef with me, but we got through it. All right, so completed level eight. All right, now we're going. Okay, we're going to go to level nine. Fifteen seconds. Oh goody, our first dark mode in the dark. All right, how's this going to go? So we got our little shadow, and I think there is an option. I did read on Twitter. Oh, um. They added some thing where, like, some people have trouble with these, just seeing them well, and oh my god. It's hard to talk and play this one at the same time. Um, but I think you do have the option, like, until they figure out another way to make it easier to see or to do whatever. You can skip these. I remember on the original stream, the, there was one of these where I just got stuck on. I beat two or three of them. But there was one that I just... Oh, why did I move that way? This one seems doable. I just got to quit being dumb. Alright. Get away from you. Yeah, you... Oh, dear. Oh, I hit the side. And, of course, something like this. You got to just have it where you can just start instantaneously. If there are any loading times... I think it would be just too frustrating and people would, probably people wouldn't stick with it. You just got that one more time, one more time kind of a thing. Okay, we're going to try to stay away. Yeah, I don't know, it's something with these shadows that I just, I don't know. It makes it slightly more, like, in interesting, but harder. Which is probably in my head, but... Okay, get out of there. Oh boy. Oh, really? Oh, so close. Yeah, in the dark. Let me see. Back. Yeah, there doesn't. There's no skip thingy, or whatever. But I don't know if it's like if you fail so many times, or you just go to the. I don't know if there's something under options or whatever. But I, I do remember reading that somewhere on one of their recent tweets, right before release, I think. Like, you can skip these. I should be able to do this, I swear. And there's also something with... Oh, jeez, I just got clustered around there. There's something about... I don't know, a game like this that I don't normally kind of play. But... Huh, people are watching, and so... You know, you want to be cool, or you just want to, like, not suck than you do, which is a no god almighty, that or there was not much I could go there. They didn't have all the levels in, in the original, uh, <sighs> the original demo, um, Trying but, to talk and play this is not easy. Yeah, I think there were... I don't remember how many levels I got through. At least, like, 20 or so. I think there were 30 in the... Oh! Yeah! Survive! No! Hey, we got it. Woo! All right. Well, all right, level 9 Still is... Still alive! Just kidding. Yeah. Sorry, I had to do it. All right. All right. Oh, okay, that gives an interesting clue. Treadmill. That's kind of an inside joke, Carl. Treadmill. Okay. Whoa, howdy. That was Hello. An interesting. Oh, okay. I get it. I think. We're kind of going around in a circle because the patterns are there's like little blocks and then they'll fall oh! away. Oh! Huh. He said I bought the barbecue sauce just in case. Ah. So. Uh. Fi oh, okay, now we gotta, okay, split. Now it's not just survival. Now we gotta collect tokens. I remember these, yeah. Oh, Jesus, okay, hi. Uh, okay, I see what we did. Okay, yeah, collect. That is our mode. Gotta play a little bit. Oh, Jesus. And they're moving pretty good. 
Come okay, on. we have. Damn it. C E X underscore simple watching. Okay, thanks for joining. Playing a little hyper dot, trying not to die. And we gotta collect. Oh man, five. We gotta collect. That's right. Okay, we only did two. Oh. You know, it's those stray ones that get me. Like if it was just dodging, like kind of going across the street, you know, going in between the lines, that's not so bad, but I keep... Okay, he appeared over there. Oh, God. Oh, that was stupid. Collect. Okay, we got that. And zap over there. Okay. Oh! Where we get three that time? Get out of the way there. Come on, spawn. I know you're gonna. Two. Three. Four. Five. Haha. <laughs> we got this. All right. Six tokens. Hunted. Oh, lovely. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, we got one, two. Oh, and then I just sat there for a second too long. All right, fair enough. One, two, three, high, and okay, failure. <laughs> yeah, this game is kind of hard to talk and play. One. That's why you got your collar commentator over here, so you can concentrate. Uh-huh. All right. One. I don't want to get bunched up in a corner here. Uh, hi, how you doing? Two, three. Oh, that was bad. There's a lot of things surrounding me when I got that third one. Okay. One. Two. Oh! I, I'm doing really bad. Just got the second one, and then... Okay. And I think you can kind of tell, I think, by the like the shapes that you're fighting. I, I think I see kind of a little pattern here of like, oh, okay, these pieces behave this way. Like, the triangles, they'll hunt you down. These other ones, they move in the straight line. All right, got it. There we go. Hunted. All right. Level... F okay, 14 seconds... Oh, ice storm. Now we get to slide. Okay. Okay. Oh, dear Jiminy. Yeah, there's definitely Yeah, this some... is the one you stopped on. Uh, it's a little slightly different, actually. Because, uh, but it was the same concept. Yeah, oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, there's definitely some sliding going around here. There's, uh, you're kind of skidding, so you just kind of go with the momentum, no momentum and hope to God... There we go, we survive. All right. Oh, okay, unlocked group E, okay. Beat 16 levels, unlock group E. Fair enough, all right. Ice storm, okay, now we go to 18 seconds, silence, all right. What was it? Silence. Oh. Oh no, it is another dark one. Ooh. <laughs> 18 seconds, I think it said. Although there's not as. M oh, man, I, I opened my big mouth. It's like there wasn't as many, and then they just kind of all snuck up on me. Trevor Johnson 13 thing. Okay. Hey, Trevor. Thanks for oh, joining. Oh, Steve's in. Okay. And no, just Gavin's in here again. Okay. Wow, okay. Thanks for coming in, guys. Got a small crew. I can't really talk too much right now. This is a... And I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. Sorry tricky level. If I'm not doing that, I apologize. Playing a little bit of HyperDot on PC. It's available now. It's like 20 bucks, I think. It's a very simple game in concept, but 
Can be. Oh man, why didn't I go to the right sooner? And it's always weird watching these things back because you're watching somebody else play, even yourself, and you're like, man, if you would have just done this, you would have been just home free. But when you're in the thick of it, you're like, you don't even think about stuff. If you didn't catch it, we're in HyperDot. Yeah, HyperDot. Just came out on Friday, the 31st. And uh, I played the demo of it ahead of time. They wanted to check out some, ah, damn it, some accessibility stuff. And so I got a little sneak peek, liked what I saw, liked what I played. And uh, yeah, gr oh, man, I grabbed it right away. And basically, it's like there are some slight changes to the objectives. It's usually survive, but sometimes you got to collect tokens. Uh, but it's basically this pacifist puzzle game. You try to avoid everything you can. Please stay alive. Please stay alive. Get away from me. Thank you very much. Okay, now I will grab some water real quick. There we go. All right, got our dark level done. 15 seconds. On the green, and man, like, I just, I wish more UI, like, this is a game I'm going to point to. Eagle Island and this one, even. Um, I don't know if Sequence Storm has a lot of font size options, but, you know, they do full narration. But as far as, like, low vision -y accessibility and, uh, like, font size, boy, this one and Eagle Island. I wish more games would be just so much easier to read like this. Oh, okay. Oh, area. Oh, okay, we gotta stay in this little circle within a circle. And now it's gonna move somewhere else. Okay, it's gonna move up there. And we gotta get so many seconds. Ow! Oh. Steve likes this. He says he used to shoot marbles when he was a kid. I guess it reminds him of a... I could see that, yeah. I could see that. And Carl's teasing Trevor. He's like, oh no, it's Trevor! Ah! Man, I did so well the first time, blew it right at the end, but, okay, get out. And you can, you don't, you don't have to stay in there, I don't think, the whole time, if you bounce out, it's just how many, oh, really? And I didn't even realize it, but today's Groundhog Day. Oh, yeah, I did see something about that on Twitter, I think, and I think if I remember correctly, he did, he, whatever makes it shorter, if he did see a shadow, I think it's shorter or something, I don't remember how that works. Goody, early spring. Yo! Yeah, I'm all for that. Oh, okay. But according to see, uh, according to Steve, we only have two seasons anyway: winter mm. and August. <laughs> He's like Riley didn't even cast a shadow. He's giving me shit. Hmm. Excuse me. Ugh. Ah, failed again. Area. Yeah, it's even colder when you're outside. <laughs> Gets chilly. Although it's been actually really nice out. I heard it was supposed to get up in the 40s this weekend. Almost. Dang. So, I'd be okay with that. Melt some of this ice away. I'd be good with that. I'd be really good with that, because the snow sucks, but... Ice is worse. Ice is not really fun. Oh, god, that was really badly played. Half paying attention, half... And that was totally my fault. Yeah, I like these regular modes. These, uh, the dark, dark ones. I mean, the regular high contrast ones I like, but... Yeah, okay. Yeah, hey, so Steve, were you any good at marbles? Damn it. I never really played marbles. Uh, Steve did. I remember uh, used to, like, when I was little, we'd, my, I'd go, my grandparents would hang out at one of the bars. That, oh, well, the one you were at. And they used to have a shuffleboard. Mm -hmm. I used to play the shuffleboard. That was kind of fun. 
play with that a little bit. Oh, okay. Pay attention. Yeah, shuffleboard was kind of interesting. Okay. It's not hard. Like, it. this might not make sense, but it's not hard, but it's easy to mess up, if that makes any sense. Not something that I would be able to do and talk, let me tell you. Well, you do this long enough. That's uh, that's that's the trickiest part. Is like there's certain games that are just like rhythm games, or just some people can do it better than others. I mean, some people can just oh, okay, I'll just do this thing on expert or hard mode or whatever and have no problem. But um, certain things I'm better at. I can do shooters fairly well, but ugh, this is really not that hard. I don't know why I'm just this isn't. That it's not that it's super hard right now. I'm kind of just casually playing, and you know what? You need to get out of here, you stupid triangle. Arg! Arg! What do I need? 18 seconds, I think. I said, get out of there. Yeah. See, the the pieces move in different, like the shapes, they move in different ways. So the squares are more round. Oh man, random. Triangles kind of chase you down. I know I can do this, it's just I'm... <sighs> really? Uh, no, we didn't beat it. We, uh, he got stuck in a level, and then he showed us a little bit of level four. Or, episode four, I mean. Yeah, which is basically... A nightmare. Yeah, that's probably the closest thing I would say, yeah. Hey, Steve, you shut up, by the way. 59, you shut up. Huh? He told us, it's 59, here, suck it. Oh. I told him, shut up. <laughs> yeah, it was nice in Seattle, too. It wasn't too bad. It was like the 40s and 50s. There we go. We got it. Completed. All right. On the green, yeah. And you'll be in Cali in a few weeks, so you just shush. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully so will I. All right, hidden shapes. Okay, 25 seconds. Oh no, we got another dark one. This might have been, this might have been one of the ones that I did eventually beat, but it took me forever. This would probably be one that I struggled at. These dark ones, mm, I don't know. Because you have restricted visibility, too, is the thing. I mean, that's the whole... You've got this sort of spotlight view of... Like, there's where you are, but good luck seeing anything else around you. Oh, it's so close. No! How long did I last? Does it say? Failed. Really? Really? 24.4 seconds. Oh, man. For God's Not fair, sake. Game. Really? Couldn't it just let me have that extra few tenths of a second? All right, then. All right, then. Not nice, Hyperdot. Not nice. 24.4 seconds. Oi! Kind of stay away from the sides, too, because then you never know when they're... Oh, God! 23.1. Because uh, you never know when they're going to come in from the edges, and that was totally my fault. Yeah, the music just... It's kind of just ambient. It's just kind of fades in the background like you hear it, but it's nothing too doesn't jump out at you, which is kind of what you need. Okay, oh god, okay, I was going to say, how am I going to escape that little fiasco? Going to dodge these guys, try to stay away from, yeah, this limited field of view is just, kind of psychs you out a little bit. Stay away from the crowd. 22. 
so close. But yeah, um, like I said, gonna watch the Super Bowl later. I think it'll be a good game, I hope, based on the playoff games that I've seen so far. Kind of looking forward to it. I know the last several years I really haven't cared, because A, I'm just tired of seeing New England. Glad they're not in there this time. And, uh, yeah, glad the Packers aren't in there. And, uh, like I said, oh, God, I wasn't sure where I was going to go with that. 21 seconds again. Um, yeah, I mean, I hope, based on what we've seen in the other games, I hope we they give us a good show. Like I said, I don't have my W2 to distract me this time. So. I remember that like it was yesterday. Yeah. Like I said, the things I remember. God. The last time I remember <sighs> on Super Bowl Sunday, I Damn remember it. it was funny because that whole weekend, it was he did his video on Saturday, and his voice was all raspy because he he was at a concert the night before, so he went to the Disturbed show. Oh yeah, that was the yep, February first. Yep. Wasn't it Three Days Grace? Yeah, Three Days Grace and uh, Disturbed. Disturbed. That's and, what I thought. Uh, I thought Sound of Silence live. Yeah. That but was um, it was funny because that week before, me and Steve, it started off me and ah. Steve. I don't even remember what started it. But me and Steve were talking about L4D, Left for Dead. And <sighs> Where did you come from? We were talking about different things in it. And I was bragging to him about the audio, you know, and all the sound effects and everything. And. Damn it. So he's sitting Erg. there and he's Jesse had not seen it yet, and then he happened to come on Twitter for some reason. I think it was and I had mentioned, you know, we were talking about it. And cuz he didn't know how much vision Jesse actually had. He knew he was legally blind, well, illegally sighted, but yeah. He didn't know how uh. much sight he had. So I was like, yeah, he's able to play it. That's how I watched it. Well, so we're talking about it, and he says, you know, you two, you're really making me want to play Left 4 Dead again. And at the time that he were, that he was, that we were talking about this, he was having issues with Mixer, not archiving streams, and not, you know, not putting them in there. So he was recording with Bandicam a lot at that time. He wasn't doing OBS yet. And so... Ah, oh, get away from me. He was still sometimes recording with Mixer, but if it didn't archive it, he had his Bandicam backup. Well, turned around and... Oh my, that was close. Super Bowl Sunday rolled around and the game was just bad. Yeah, yeah, it was boring. It was boring as hell. So halftime rolls around. He does his taxes during halftime. <laughs> then he's like, screw it. This is boring. It's annoying. So he comes on Sunday night and goes, I'm going live on Mixer for some fun or something like that. I don't remember how he worded it. And I'm like, oh, sweet. So oh, I go yeah. in. And I get in, and I hear, all I hear is, oh, no, the thing, and I'm like, oh, it's Left for Dead. I recognize the beginning right off. He hadn't played the intro, just the, the music, the little backup music you get when the intro's over. Mm -hmm. that's, what was, that's all that was playing. Then he comes back in, because he's fighting with Mixer again. <sighs> and so he comes in, he's like talking about it on, tw that we, you know, having the conversation on Twitter. And so he plays it. And it was a stream that I, I really liked because of something that was said in the second campaign. Please and stay. So, no. So he, he, there was something that was said in the second campaign, and I'm like, man, I hope that archived because Mixer sometimes didn't archive things. Well, I didn't know it archived until August. <laughs> Yeah, originally I was just doing, like, mixers, just, ah, it'd be a random Wednesday or Saturday video, and then as I was building enough of them up, uh, kind of started the whole mixer Monday sort of a thing, just, okay, we'll release these on Mondays, because that way they don't cut into your regularly scheduled Programming. nonsense. And he, he came to Oi! me, he goes, hey, Riley, I got a question for you. He actually asked my opinion on it. What was that? Was that on Skype or was that on... I have no clue. Because I know we was together at the time and he, he came to me and he goes, Riley, I got a question. And I said, like, shoot, what's up? He goes, I'm thinking about it. He says, I got a lot of Mixer videos. And he says, I don't want to use them as regular videos because they're so much longer. Get away from me. A lot of them are so much longer. He goes, 
I'm thinking about doing a Mixer Monday, and I'm like, yeah, I think that's a great idea. That way, you know, you can get your other videos in, give other games, you know, their time. You know, to be fair to them, give them their time and their spotlight. Mm -hmm. Because a lot of the stuff we're playing is, you know, old classics and some of the stuff he's already played. So I figured, hey, you know, give these other games their airplay. Yeah. And if there's something like this one, I have a feeling... You know, if this does record, this might be a tomorrow video just because I want to plug... Oh, man! 20 seconds. Um, you know, I, I do want to plug it since it's kind of a time-sensitive thing and I want to get, you know, give them some attention for making kind of a really cool, in some ways, accessible game. I mean, it's not totally blind accessible, but it has a lot of other cool things and just the nature of the input being, like, so minimal that a lot of people should be able to play it. And even I'm going to comment on it because, hey, and like I said, even though, like I said in A4G yeah. today, even though I can't play Go it, I still like it too because pesky, it has accessibility in it. Pesky things. Dude! Mm, that was only 18 seconds. It felt longer than that. It felt longer than that. Yeah, these, I don't know. I get why I get it, but they just psych me out for some reason. And I seem to have way more trouble with these than I should. He's no, no, just Gavin says Viva on New England. Yeah, uh, boo New England. I'm just so tired of them. He also says I could make this game. Yeah? Oh! He says, uh, Patriot fan in here, who day? Steve did. He's a Bengals fan, so he's keeping he this Patriot fan in here. Okay, we zip through there. Oh, and then I got hit by that guy on the bottom. We got some smack talkers in here now. This is gonna be good. Mm. Now, I have no illusions on my team. They do really well, and then they always find a way to choke. So it's just, it's just, you, you know, one of those things that you just learn to expect. You're like, oh yeah, they're doing great, cool, I'm, they're fine, but no, they're just gonna find a way to mess it up. Don't you dare stay there oh ho -ho, we beat it yeah yeah go vikings <laughs> go vikings 14 seconds glide oh i think i just saw this on the menu when we came in oh okay it's one of those area ones all righty okay so oh we got a oh it's an icy okay okay okie dokie this is gonna be intriguing and kind of terrible because spring training in a couple of ice weeks. physics Woo! ice physics and you got to stay in a <sighs> yeah this one might be a little challenging I can see it better but the moment I start moving it just goes all topsy-turvy here and it's They'll start coming home from work. Who are they playing? Because it'll be spring training. Yeah, baseball fans are kind of lucky because they get like so many games a year. You get to watch like hundreds of games a year. Well, baseball fans that have that bat are luckier. Well, yeah. <laughs> football you only get like 17 weeks out of the year and then if you're lucky you get playoffs but yo boy. Well, that's a rougher sport too if you guys had as many games as baseball you wouldn't have any team well games. yeah that's just that's why they can because a lot of times and that's what's really funny to me is like baseball like they they're the ones that always go on strike yet you basically get paid to stand there for most of the time like man well that's a that's a pretty good gig I wouldn't be complaining if I got a couple hundred thousand dollars a year. I'd be good with that. Oh, this one is tough. Because the area is one thing, but the ice physics, mmm, boy. 
are kind of brutal. Wow. This one's a little tricky. What do you predict, Steve? How do you think they're going to do this year with all their moves? Well, it seemed like they did okay last year from when I saw you or when I heard you guys. The Reds? Didn't they? No. I thought they... No, they I thought they had a pretty good winning stretch for a little while. Not really good. Oh. They weren't that good last year. Uh, oh my god. This one... Hmm. The more I can... I mean, they've won oh. a few, but the, I mean, they were, they were under five. Ah. Uh. Shit. Oh yeah, these ice physics are... Not friendly. I'm just gonna try to stay in one spot until I have to move, and then then I totally die again. Uh, move and maybe. Oh, okay. That shouldn't have moved up there. Ugh. Ah! He says he is smack talking the shit. Steve says Bengals only lost two Super Bowls. Patriots lost five. Ah. Uh. Oh my god, Steve. No, just Gavin says, good game. And then Kane, Duh. aka Carl, said, he could do that too, just let him know when the ball's coming. Meaning baseball. Oh, yeah. No, I, I tried to play baseball or softball, those kinds of things in Fayette, and just with depth perception and stuff and it was always really hard to I hated playing I hated baseball because it was just hard to swing and I'm lucky to get hits I hated playing it I mean it would have been fun if I could have done it but with my vision it was just I was terrible at it okay stay away from me oh god No. Yeah, I talked to Harry briefly earlier today, and he goes, "Yeah, I even heard they're gonna ruin the Super Bowl because they're gonna put some, a couple of political ads in." It's like, oh God, really? We can't even escape during football anymore. Bullshit is what it is. No. Yeah. I'll be so glad when this year's over in a way, because I just all you're gonna hear is election nonsense on everybody fighting on Twitter and just ugh. ugh. I swear I might avoid freaking Twitter except for notifications when that starts rolling around. Yeah, well, it's still people are already with like some of the primaries and people are throwing fits and just I gotta I gotta figure out. I know you can block certain terms and things like that. I gotta figure out how to do that because I might just see if I can figure out how to block a few keywords. Like anything that says Democrat or Republican or election or just like, you know what, I don't care. I mean, I, I care, but I don't want to be But we don't need all the bashing and trash talking. With that in my feed. I gotta figure out how to do that. This level's hard, by the way. This is not easy. I mean, it's it's, it's ridiculous that, you know, they always say you don't discuss sex, religion, and polit politics. Right. Damn it. And how long do I have to last here? Oh, God, only 14 seconds. Ugh. That seems like a long time, because... I, I mean, gotta be in the. I gotta be in this stupid thing for 14 seconds total. Ugh. I can usually get through the first one, but the second wave. This when the when the circle moves is when things really go south. It just they those little triangles start coming in, and then things go real south. Okay, we got the second. Where are you gonna be? Okay, you're gonna be there. 
Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me, you damn triangle. And you circles, diamonds, and... Oh, 13.8, I hate you. That's just mean. Really? 13.8, for criminy's sake. And then I screwed that up. That's just me. <sighs> yeah, it's not a good feeling. And neither is that. I'm trying to stay in the middle of these while I, uh, while I can. Because it's not just 14 seconds, I gotta be 14 seconds in these circles. President Lush, who's voting? No, you, this... President Lush. Trump, move over. It's President Lush. <laughs> right, Steve? You can beat Trump in the election? <laughs> I wouldn't even want the job. It's like, I don't want to be management. I don't want to be... Would you vote for Steve? President. Oh, you know, hey, I'd, I mean, if it was between him and Trump, yeah. Oh! <laughs> there I'm... you go, Steve. You gotta vote. <laughs> I'm not doing any of my politics stuff, though. I just basically blank a statement and say, I think they're all dingbats and leave it at that. God! Hey, Steve, that means you're going to be a dingbat one of these days, right? Ha ha ha. They're all just awful. Awful people. I didn't mind Obama, but... Damn it! My dog... My... Hell, my guide dog was staring at the damn screen when he was on. He liked his voice. Hmm. Oh, God, get away from me. Get away from me, okay. Where's No, get away from me, you blasted shape. <laughs> Dang, man, this level is just brutal. And it, like I said, I'm sure there are some people that are just like, oh, this is easy, and just fly through it like that. But yeah, well, and they're probably excited too. It's so. not me. <laughs> it's not me. I just got to keep kind of swirling around here because, like I said, the ice physics, you go in one... Oh, hey! Haha! -ha, we beat it! Five tokens gated. Okay, so... What what fresh hell is this going to be? Oh, my. Okay, that's what we're going to do. That's very interesting! You got to get tokens? Wow. Not nice. This could be difficult. Oh my, ha ha ha. So not nice. Okay. I'm gonna... Okay. You know what I think I'm gonna do is we're just gonna... Okay. Oh, okay. It's not... I'll just use a cheap strategy here. It might take a little longer, but... There's certain places based on the patterns where they literally can't hit you. Oh, and I totally got greedy. I thought I could make it, but... Grab that one. See so if I stay here in the middle. Grab that, go down the middle. Hi, how you doing? Uh, go in the middle. Yeah, okay, that's a good place to be, yeah. Do that. No, you come over, okay. There we go, yes. see? Okay, idle. Idle. 15 seconds. Okay, hey, at least we don't have ice physics now. But we do have our little sub-circle. Oh, hi, and we have some triangles that got a little angry, a little vicious. Oh, it's so nice not having ice physics! And these triangles just come out of nowhere. They're fast. It's like you got these little squares, and then all of a sudden it's like, oh, hi, Mr. Triangle. How you doing? Carl just said bad shapes. Yeah. 
get these, and like I said, any second we're gonna get, yeah, they just beeline right for you. You almost have to just be like, okay, we're gonna get out of the circle, figure out where these little triangles are gonna go, get back in, and we go, oh god, we got a lot of particles here. Yeah! Okay, there's more. We needed 15 seconds, and we only got eight. Oh, joy. Eight. Eight seconds. That's All a right, good move. Now we got to zip away and fail. I went in the complete direction that they were coming from. I took a wild guess and failed. Okay, we... God. You ever see that movie? Eight seconds? I've heard of it. Um, but I know. No, I have not. That's a good movie. It's the uh, life and times of the late uh, Lane Frost. Who? He's a bull rider. Oh. <sighs> Those triangles, man. Okay, you're coming from that way. Okay, there's a lot of triangles in here. You could... Just go away, triangles. Oh, well, there's a lot of other shapes that kind of got put in there too, but those, yeah. Okay, we're... shoot. All right. Stay in here as long as we can. Zip out of there, get back in. Like I said, is as many in that. Okay, we got that. Oh, jeez. Yeah, you just get surrounded. <sighs> Wonder. I know they said there were over 100 levels. I can only imagine what. Oh, wow. Just zip in right from the side there. I wonder how many, or I wonder what the final levels are. I mean, I, I, this, I'm sure this game just gets ridiculously hard. Oh, I bet. Reminds me of, like, the pacifist mode in Geometry Wars. Which I also was terrible at. <laughs> Geometry Wars was a really cool game, but I was not good at it. Really cool, all just arcadey looking game, early 360 game. All right, I, I couldn't get back into the circle. There's too many things around. Too many shapes to dodge. Get in the particle, get away from me. Okay, you, oh, and then you come out from there, uh-huh. Of course you do. Because that's where I needed to be. Oh, then more came over there. Area. Okay, where are you going to be? Yay! A lot of shapes. Dang. Okay, they're going to come that way. shooter, but it's still pretty pretty tense at times. Oh, and then it comes right at the edge. Yeah, put them... Yeah, where are they going to come in? Where are they going to come in? Because, okay. Ugh. I hate when they put the circles kind of toward the edge, because then you don't have much time to react when particles come in from god knows where around the edges of the circle because you got the circular arena and then you have the sub circle that you're trying to oh my lord that was only nine seconds and i gotta get 15 oh good grief oh and i should have known better should have known better Okay, 
we've got a lot of seconds on that one. Oh God, come on. Yeah, these big ones, these like diamonds and stuff, they're okay, but you know, they're a little slower, but yeah, these, oh, see, now we're right by the edge too, so the moment one of these triangles zip in, we gotta get away. Okay, we're gonna just avoid that. And uh, if you particles would just, man, they're everywhere and they're just guarding, it's like they're guarding this stupid circle. Them, I. Oh, we made it eleven seconds. <laughs> Four to go. All right. All right, let's give it a little bit more. We'll give it a few more shots, and then we might try to just explore and see what other levels we get. Just go to the menu, and since we do have several levels unlocked, ugh, and it seems like they're gated by how many levels you beat, so you can probably go back and play them later if you wanna try to beat them. And it seems like it's a pass or fail. It doesn't. I don't know if there's any like star ratings or S rating, you know, like S rank or you know stuff like that. It's either you pass or fail, I think. So. Go away, you stupid. Oh my. Okay, that one came kind of fast. And where are you? God almighty. Oh yeah, Carl. Later I will Whoa. be having barbecue wings. Whoa, there was a lot of dudes there. Yeah, He'll what? have pizza, I'll have wings. Yep. He got a pizza yesterday from all the points that he had. Yep, free pizza for me. I figured it was just easier to order yesterday, seeing as how everybody's going to be ordering today. Ah. Oh, that was terrible. Five more tries, and we'll look at a different level. Five more reasonable tries. Like, if I bite it right away, I won't count it, but... Alright, there's one, so we got four left. Usually when I threaten... Oh, see, that one doesn't really count, because that was... I gotta at least get through the first circle. Then that counts as a try. Okay, so this is okay. Well, there's three left. Sometimes when I threaten, like, okay, that's enough, then that's when I do it. So that one didn't count because I didn't beat the circle. Okay. Alright, this one counts. Holy god, there's a lot of dudes again. Two left. Whoa, hi. Okay, this one counts. Hi. All right, last one. Okay, that one doesn't count because I didn't quite get the circle. Ugh. Hate when they put them right on the edge, too, because then the other one, like I said, these things just zip right in, and you're like, oh, okay. Oh, wow. I'm just doing absolute rubbish. Terrible. Oh. Trying one problem too many times, and I'm just getting worse and worse. Okay, this one counts, and that's it. All right, let's see what we got. So, idle we didn't get. I just want to see if it tells me, like, 
Oh, okay, so they're, oh, you know what? They're actually, there's check marks to the right of them. So, yeah, I must have had the demo still installed and I counted these. So, okay, this one I have not actually beaten, apparently, because, and we're, oh, we're on D. So, we're basically, I think, right where we started, non-stop. I think this is, okay. Oh, it's another ice one. And I didn't look how many seconds. Oh, we gotta collect. <laughs> okay, we gotta collect tokens. And I don't know how many, so we're just gonna try to zip. Failed. Um, three tokens out of eight. Oh boy. Alrighty, icy and three token or eight tokens. Okay. Yep. Got two. Oh, wow. Only got two that time. Yeah, you start moving and. Okay, get two. Three. Oh! That stupid little thing. I thought I could squeeze through. Almost got three. One. Two. Ow! And fail. Yeah, these are getting it's kind of hitting the point where I do terrible. <laughs> those red ones, I gotta say, some of those, there's a couple of triangles, the colors that kind of don't see them quick enough sometimes. I mean, I see them, but they don't stand out quite as much as some of the other shapes do. So kind of bump into those a little bit more frequently it's on this ice level especially the other ones are fine but like on the ice because it's kind of got this weird you know you can kind of tell it's like a some diagonal lines to represent some slippery ice texture jesus I want to see something really fast. Um, because if I go to settings, I think accessibility. Because I think this might have been turned on. I want to see what it looks like with the animated backgrounds. Is oh, okay, and on and off. So I didn't really notice much. Let's see what's. It, I want to see what it looks like now. I mean, the, the play field looks the same. But. Oh, those red triangles. Yeah, some of. I see it, but yeah, they don't stand out quite as well. Like, I wish they were. I mean, maybe they have different properties than the uh, regular uh, triangles, but I kind of like them to be all sort of brighty colors, because. Those, oh god. Okay, we got a few. I don't know how many we have. It doesn't matter. And it's all random. They just appear in random places, so you never know where. Uh, you never know where the particles or the uh, tokens are going to be. Collect. Two high, get away from me. Three, four, ah, and then I hit a triangle. I think four is my top so far on this one. Two, three, and an instant fail. Ooh, that was bad. I wonder if you can, like, you can make custom levels. I wonder how easy it is, like, can you view publicly if anyone else has created levels? Or do you have to, like, can you share them with anyone? Or is it only you can play your created levels? 
We might have to take a look at that just to see, because I kind of want to see what free play is. Like if you can, maybe you can set the, I don't know if you can set like the difficulty or, good God, they just, they're just everywhere. Um, just kind of seeing what... options they have in these different modes. Hi. I think we've got three. Well, it doesn't matter. One. Yeesh. And I bet you people have made some real dick levels, too. Oh, I'm sure. Because usually, that's what I, that was kind of my problem with Mario Maker, is a lot of them they kind of make these just brutally difficult levels and it's like hey let's see how tough we are and like you know i, I just want to play a fun level and they play ones it's like yeah it took me like three days of constant play to try to get this uploaded because i can't even beat my own level um so there's a lot of like these just brutally they call them kaizo levels you can you you can sort like whether they're more hardcore or uh, they have little filters you can apply, but sometimes they don't even work the best. We'll give this one a few more tries and then we'll maybe pop into E a little bit and see what it has to offer. See if there's any sort of new gimmicks to any of these levels. Because we've got the collection ones, we've got the ice ones, we've got the little circle things that you got to stay in. Um, you know, patterns, but a lot of it's either survive or collect so far. See if there's any other Ugh, level. To, yeah, let's just uh Alright, level E. Oh, okay, I can just go. Alright, so slow and steady. Oh goody, we get to collect in the darkness. Oh god, I'm just thinking, what if there was ice in these levels? Because you know that's going to be a thing eventually. And I forgot I didn't look how many I got to collect. Ugh! Alright, I got to collect six. One. Oh boy. I wish I were better at this game, I really do. I like to play it, never said I was good at it. Okay, we got two, get away from me. No, oh, there's a thingy right there. One. Okay, two. Three. Four, five. Come on, give me another piece. Yeah. Yes. Nice. Two just spawn right next to each other. I'm like, yes, please. Get lucky every once in a while. Okay, slow and steady. We beat that. Oh boy, eight tokens. Haste. Oh yay. Oh, it's a tiny. We're zoomed out a little bit. Okay. Oh. I'm tiny, and we have big shapes. Interesting. Oh, and I got too close to that. I got greedy. Okay. Okay. Uh, move a... There's a lot of shapes. Dear God, there's a lot of shapes. Oh, that, how is that one right there? Okay. One, two, three, four. Oh God, how am I gonna get you? Bah, ha, ha. Okay, I got some. Where are you gonna be? Uh, oh my God, there's too many. I they like they multiply. That's probably why it's haste. You gotta get them as quickly as possible. You just get overwhelmed. Oops. 
This one's kind of evil. Okay, where are you going to meet? Two. Three. I'd like to get that, but there's all these other shapes. Jesus. Yeah, you got to do some serious weaving. And I don't know that I have the skill for that. In the in these one, two, three. Where are you gonna be? Okay. Ow! Couldn't get around. Yeah, really unique idea for a game though, I gotta admit. One, two, and it's cool that they're adding accessibility features. I like it. Now if they'd make a feature that would just make me better at the game. <laughs> now we're talking. That's the accessibility feature I need. Okay, we're gonna circle around there. We're gonna grab that. And, oh. Okay, it's gonna be the Oh, dear God in heaven, there's... Shoops! Uh-huh. Grab that one. Oy va. That one I got kind of squished in there. How many did I get? Oh, I got seven. No. So close. Not nice. Game, not nice. Yeah, but I mean, at least if you get that many, there's hope. I don't know how much hope, but there is hope. Three. Are gonna be four, five, and I hit the thing. I went too fast. One, two, three. Come on. Four. I think it was. Okay, let's get over there. Ah! Damn it! There were two right beside each other too. gonna get the I don't remember how many of those are six I got oh ah. one two three oh, four five six and then you oh. chased me down man Trying to beeline right around that dumb diamond. One, two, oh god almighty, three, okay, four. I think, I don't remember, I lost count. Four. Oh god, oh my god, there's no way I was gonna get through that. Yeah, that was poorly played. One. Two. Three. Ah. Uh. Carl says nothing like a fumble around in the dark, lol. Yeah. Yeah, that reduced visibility is not fun. Okay, we got two. Whoa. Three, four, five. Yes! Ah, I couldn't get in. One, two, three. side. Hi. One. Two. Three. And you make me cross the 
whole level. Frick! Alright. No. One. Two. Ah. Gotta get seven ones. I don't know. One. Oh, that was... I don't know what I was thinking there. I, was, I guess I was trying to get more to the middle so I could go to any direction where it spawned. But one, two, three... Ugh. Yeah, there just gets to be so many. One. Three, two... get you. Uh! I knew that was going to be bad even if I got it. Uh, how do we get you? Oh, God! The main thing is I think you got to be patient. See, these tokens, they will disappear after a while, too, though. One, two, three. Yo! Like, I want to move on, but, like, I'm, I kind of want to beat this one. And it's just, eh. One, two... I'm not even going to worry about that one. I'm just going to try to stay alive. And if they spawn near me, I will try to get it. Uh, oh, God. And there's like, oh, yeah? Whoa, what are you doing? What? One. Hush. Two. It just started talking in the background there. Oh. Well, at least we know three, we're live still. Four. Fair enough. went too far. One. Two. Oh, that was dumb. Yeah, you guys right. got a little bit of echo there. Sorry about that. That's alright. Well, like I said, uh... A little harder for a little harder for me to talk and play it this play this one. Uh, this one, especially after the first few levels. Well, is there anything you want me to talk about while we're on here, and then you can just play and I'll yap? I don't really have much going on. I really don't know. I mean, it's kind of up to you, I guess. Uh, <laughs> Not too much, really. Nope, not really. I mean, like oh. I said, the big thing that happened to me, I mentioned last night in mm -hmm. last night's stream. Which, I'll go ahead and tell Carl again, since Carl's in here, since it was the first thing. Um, he didn't get to hear it because he hasn't seen... Shh. You'll actually see me break down again in that one podcast, Carl, that I'm not going to mention a name of on here, but um, in the <clears throat> personal podcast, mm -hmm. you'll see me break down again because... I got a follow from one of another one of my big time favorite developers recently on Twitter. Left for Dead, Carl. Their actual developer followed me on Twitter Thursday night. Talk about me get to be an emotional wreck. I was yeah. Okay. 
spawn Which somewhere cool. where I can get you. Oh my god, look at all those shapes. Oh my god. How do you want me to survive that? But yeah, big time event for me. And also, Carl, I don't know if you knew, but um, if you wanted to send over a message, we're doing a little celebration on my one year anniversary for an advocacy. And if you wanted to send either like, a, if you have like a question you wanted to ask me, because Jesse's basically going to be interviewing me on A4G. So, one. Um, if you want to do that, which we're going to announce it on the channel better when he actually says it, because he's going to probably mention it as well on the update. But basically, we're doing a one year anniversary interview type thing where he's going to ask questions like my biggest moment as an advocate, stuff like that, just different things. So if there's a question you want to ask me about my advocacy in the past year or just a little message to put on there, and we're going to put it on A4G in between the segments. We're going to do segments with it. And then we're going to basically do like an interview. He's going to basically host, and I'm going to basically be the guest oh. in a matter of putting it. Jeez, that's a lot of shapes. That's so many shapes. So that's pretty much what's going on with A4G and with us, basically, with that. And that will be out the same day that Doom, Doom Eternal comes out, which I cannot wait for. So you can send it, if you oh, want to send a message in, Carl, you can send it to that email address that you have and I'll be able to copy it over. Ugh. It's like, I feel like I can do this, but at the same time, it's just it gets overwhelming and I just, ugh, I choke. Because there gets to be a lot of shapes. Gotta be really, really precise. And weaving through some of this crap later on. And Carl says, wow, awesome. Yeah, it was, it was, all I did was commented on about, you know, talk to him about the sound effects in Left 4 Dead, and they followed me. And I mean, they have like 30-some thousand followers or something like that, and only follow like 174. And I was honored to be one of them. And I'm like, dang, sweet. I mean, that's a very humbling experience. Ugh. Get me away from you. Uh, okay, we got that, that. Damn it! I don't know if that was six or seven. I hit A too quickly to know. Probably better I didn't know. It would make me angry. And then I screw up again. Yeah, I'm just looking forward to seeing. I know there's a few audio games and such, but I just want to see like what other mainstream games are going to add be adding accessibility features this year because it's really starting to catch on. Mm -hmm. Finally, which is amazing. Son of a bitch. And there's that one that I just <laughs> 6 again. give this one a few more tries and we'll kind of look around and just see if I can beat any of these levels and go check out maybe a couple of the other modes and kind of wrap up the stream. I don't know how much longer this is going to go, but good God, this game. I said it takes you about five seconds to, to learn how to play, but it gets really hard pretty fast. It's kind of like uh, the weird game Super Monkey Ball. Oh yeah. What? Yeah. Is that on the channel? Because I don't remember that one. No, there wasn't a PC version of it. There is now. There is now, but no, it used to be a GameCube thing, and then it came out to other, th other platforms. Fun game, but 
I like watching other people play, because you think I'm bad at this. Oh boy, you had to see me play that. <laughs> You're basically tilting the level and then like the ball rolls. And you're trying, you know, not to fall off. It's like a little labyrinth or whatever. And, uh, yeah, you're just going through levels and trying not to fall off the edge. And you watch some of these games done quick speed runs for it, and you're like, I don't even understand how that's physically possible, but go, dude. Yeah. I gotta watch more of those. I'm. They released most of the archives for those, and there's still some I want to watch, but. You guys really ought to watch the blindfolded. I mean, they've been doing these for a few years, so just look up like blindfold and punch out. They've done different ones for like the NES one, the original Mike Tyson's punch out. They've done ones for Super Punch Out, the Wii Punch Out, and then they're like, oh, okay, well, we're, we're, we're cocky. We're gonna, you know, blindfolded isn't good enough. We're just gonna. Um, the, there's two people there's Zellard one and Sinister one who really just get into these games and they're like, okay, well this time we're going to cooperatively play. You take the D-pad, I'll take the buttons and we're still gonna play blindfolded. And they still beat it. I'm like, good lord, I still can't even beat the game. Jesus! It was pretty amazing to watch. I'm just like, man, you just make me feel bad because I can't even beat the game regular. Mm -hmm. I get to like, I get to, uh, sometimes I can get to Super Ma or uh, Sandman, but Super Macho Man I got to once and I just got annihilated. Um, you can type in the code for Mike Tyson and it's just like, <laughs> yeah right, not a chance, because he'll knock you out in one hit if you get hit once in the first like minute and a half, so you have to survive that wave pretty much. And then if you do, you sort of have a fighting chance, but... Yeah, it's it's still a really, really fun... It's I, it's one of my favorite games, one of my favorite series, but I just... Oh, it's just so hard. But yeah, I mean, they've done blindfolded runs out of all of them. And it's pretty amazing to watch. They're fun to watch. I hope they port the Wii Punch out to the Switch. That would be cool. And I hope they get rid of the stupid pointer controls for the menus, because that's the thing that always sucked about that one. Like, the game itself is cool, but the you know, always had this gimmicky pointer control because of the Wiimote. Yeah. Okay. All right, three more times, and we got to do a new level because this is getting old. Yeah, and Carl, this guy that started the whole thing with me and that developer was was our buddy Zach from Wow Such Gaming. Totally recommend his channel, Carl, because he will describe in detail what the survivors look like, what the special infected look like. He'll tell you all kinds of lore on it. You know, he's uh, big into it. And he followed me uh, back as well last um, November 10th. Six again. And so he made a comment that they had followed him, so I follow them. And then, basically what happened was he, he even commented, because I made a comment about, Ugh. you know, the audio cues and the sound effects, and he goes, you know, just a little thing right, like that this. could help somebody. You know, and this guy doesn't have a disability, and he's commenting like that and saying, look. Lotus. All right, what are we doing? Uh, it's a survival thing, I think. Okay, I forgot. I didn't look how long I'm going to survive for. Okay, we got a... Okay, oh, okay, this is like a... Okay, I see what's going on here. Okay, yep, we got a couple patterns that we got to basically go around clock, uh, counterclockwise here. There we go, second try. There we go. Success for once. Yay. <laughs> okay, 25 seconds. Okay, what do we got here? Got some triangles, we got some shapes. Oh. Oh, is there a. Oh, is there like a. Oh, interesting. 
Was that a slow-mo thing that I just grabbed? I thought it was a token. Okay, so survive. Because there's like a tokeny thing that I grabbed and then, oh my god. Uh. Oh, these triangles, man, I swear to god. They suck. Man. They suck. He says, oh, fuck yeah. And then he says, I'll check his channel out sometime too. Yeah, it's cool. I've, I watch a lot of his videos myself. Man, I got lucky the first time and I survived long enough to see the power up, but... Okay. Really? I, I hit it and then... Yeah, he's, he's good. I mean, like I said, he's... I'm, I'm a curious type. And one of my friends had asked me, well, do you know what they look like? And I was like, uh, no. And being oh the God. dumbass, curious girl that I am, I looked them up to find out what they look like, and I found his channel. And have been watching them okay. ever since. So we're zoomed out again, too. It's a, well, it's actually a smaller arena. Because I'm crazy enough to find out what they look like. I, hey, why not? Give me a power-up. I want to know what it does. Okay. Okay, yes, it is slow. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's a lot of power. Okay. I hit the thing again. You should give me more slow mo. Oh my god, there's so many. 21 seconds out of 25. Oh boy. This could get tough. But yeah, and, and, and like, like Jesse said. I don't remember was it in a stream or if it was a um, A4G, but it's like you know, you want to know who you're, you know, what people, even if you can't see them, you kind of want to know what they look like in a sense, you know, what you're looking at. Okay, I got some other weird power up. I don't know what that did. It changed my color a little bit, or it gave me like a shield or something, but it didn't seem to do jack. I'm not sure what it did. Because I got a slow-mo thing once, and then I got a couple other power-ups. I'm not sure what they did. Uh, yeah, this is... Oh, boy. These levels are getting really hard. I get lucky, and there's certain ones that I can do well on, and then there's just ones that I just... Ugh. Just give you fit. I like the oh, game, who but... Said that? Now, who said that? No, it wasn't you. Who was it? Uh, I don't know what this power-up does. And I can't get the other one. Oh, and maybe it was a shield because I think I did actually get hit. But then I got hit again right away, so it didn't really matter. Okay. Because they were talking about, uh, I think it was Doug, wow. my friend Doug Couch. He was like talking about how uh, okay. you know you're watching cartoons and you're hearing it, but then you see it. You go and you see it. No, it was Chris. It was Chris, Eternal Noob. That's who it was. I said, I turned on who said it. It was Chris. I remember now. But he was like, you know, you're seeing all these cartoons. You're hearing them on the radio. You don't see what they look like. Like like me with them. I never seen them. I just heard them on the radio or on the YouTube channel what they look like or what, you know, what they sound like or whatever. But the curiosity gets the better of you because you're curious. Well, what do they look like? Oh, so then okay. you that find makes out. Them disappear. So that people, one, oh a lot, because even side right, people do it. They hear something like. on the radio, they gotta see it. Okay, oh god, and now it's a dark area level. Oh, good lord. This is gonna be all kinds of bad. Yeah, this is gonna be, oh boy, and I got a... That's Carl, Steve. That's my buddy from England. 18 seconds. Oof. Yes. Carl joked, he goes, hello, he says, ha ha, he says, crazy bitch, ha ha ha, lol. <laughs> Talking about me. Yup. I actually sang that song at the bar last year, to be honest with you. Oh boy, yeah, this game's wearing me out. This game is... Not even a shooter in wearing him out. <laughs> well, it's just, it's tricky. It's fun, but... I'm really bad at it. I'm really bad at it. Yeah, Buck Cherry. I was singing their song last year at the damn bar. Wow. Jesse thought that was hysterical.
Yep, I'm definitely a crazy uh, bitch. If I go looking them things up, I'm definitely crazy. Well, like I said, you know, you hear something on the radio, a cartoon, or whatever. People do. They look up what, what the characters look like. Because they see it, and then they're like, oh, that's what that looks like? Crazy wow, Riley. Losers. Curiosity kill the cat. Ugh. Well, we did unlock F. Okay, there's a collect one. We'll just see. I just kind of want to see what sort of craziness. Oh, okay, there's like power ups and tokens. Okay, I can't move anywhere because your lines are kind of getting in my w what? I, I can't even get over to where the particles were or the power ups were. Okay. Um, I can't do anything because I'm stuck in this See, Yeah, now they spawn at one in there. The lines are just not disappearing. Okay, we get that. We get that. We get that. That. Got to get them right away. Shit. All right. You got to get these right away. Because they... Shoot. They sort of make... The lines disappear. So it's really interesting how they take one tiny little mechanic and then just add so many different things to it. And oh, I'm so, yeah. <laughs> Locked in that little triangle area and then a whole bunch of little triangles come at me. So grab that, grab that, and that, and then get hit with that. Yeah, this game is quite the something else, I tell you what. <laughs> quite the something else. <clears throat> okay, that broke open. We grab that, we grab that, and then we get hit by the triangle, because of course we do. Because the triangle has to be mean. Okay, we get that. that. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah, that's not, it almost seems like it's... it's it is skill, but it's really based on luck, too. It's like, where are these pieces going to spawn? Okay, that comes there. Oh, and then I hit the triangles again. Okay. Because a lot of these little power-ups and things, they're spawning right next to the thing, so you got to try to edge to the... You know, really close to the shapes or the lines without hitting them. They love to put them there. Okay, we got that. Got that. Come on, give me another power up. I think it would be enough without those little triangle shapes coming in. The, the long pieces are enough. They really don't need to come in. I'm just saying. Okay, we got that. Yikes. It is still pretty addictive, though. I gotta admit. I know who would enjoy this game really, really, really well. Oh, oh and then they both spawn over there. Who's that? My brother, ah. Tim. Grab that, and that, and that. Him and his girlfriend like stuff like this. Hmm. No, oh, that was stupid. Walk smack right into it. Oh, how did I do that? How did I... How did I mess that up? I know Jess will be watching tonight. She's rooting San Francisco all the way. Hmm. Of course you spawned down there, because I went up here. You butt. Grab that. Okay, they're gonna come in those stupid triangles. Yeah, I think it's challenging enough with just the shapes. 
or the lines, I mean. See, now I'm cornered and I can't get out of this little pie shape here. We got triangles coming in and I can't okay, we get that. Uh, okay. Okay. Are we going to be... Oh, there's a lot of shapes. There's a lot of shapes. Oh. Shoot! I was really close on that one. That was a really good round. Okay, so they only affect like you have to kind of wait till the lines get there because they only break. Okay, they only go in like a certain radius, so they, they kind of do like what it happens when they hit the A button, except it makes the actual lines go away. Okay. Oh, that was not smart. That was really not smart. Yep because I knew the triangles were going to come and I really didn't have much room to maneuver. Not smart. Okay. You can go away now. Trapped in here with the triangles when they come in again. Yep. Ish. Now is this an F? Uh, I think so. E? Yeah. Yeah, I skipped a couple levels because they were just being brutal. Well, yeah. I just wanted to see sort of what, see what kind of variety this game has, and it's got a pretty good variety. It's got a, a lot of. Oh, that was. I should have played that better. That was actually a start of a fairly decent run. No, don't spawn them over there. Give me some over on the other side where I'm actually at. You spawn them just on the opposite side of where you are just because they can. Well, what video game would be nice if it spawned uh. where you want them at? Okay, of course they do that. Oh, that always works. They don't spawn it where you want no, it. No, I can't hit it. Right in the middle of the sh of the line. Hit that, and that, and that. That. Get away from me! Ugh. Overshot it. Oh, okay. Yep, spawn them over there, and then spawn the triangles over here. Yep, that's exactly what you're supposed to do. Yep. Yep, just so I can't get them. That's exactly what I want. Yep. Hi. How much you wanna okay, yep. Okay, well we got that. that. Ow. And even though I'm having trouble, like I said, it is still it does have some nice addictive quality to it. Oh, oh boy, yeah, I locked myself into a bad place there. Good start again. Just can't finish it off. Yeah, give me these. Here come the triangles. Oh, Steve's cousin's gonna be on the halftime show tonight. His second cousin, Megan. Oh yeah? Mm-hmm. Wow. She plays fiddle for 
It's what? She plays fiddle. Oh, so okay. She'll be on the halftime show with them. Okay. Huh. That's pretty, pretty crazy. Yeah, usually I don't watch a lot of the halftime stuff because it's just like a lot of pop bands and just bleh. Not into a lot of their shows that they have. It's kind of funny. I mean, I know they do it because you got to get like more ratings for like everybody, but like you got a violent game like football and then you play like Britney Spears or something. I'm like, oh yeah, that really makes a lot of sense. Yeah, I I, I don't get that either, really. It's, I'm, well, I mean, they do it because otherwise, you know, it's like it. It's not so much about football, it's just like everybody's there, so they gotta try to make everybody watch if they get some famous poppy person. I get it from that point of view, but it, it's still just its weird to me. Oh, I can't get it. Oh! It's always pop, too, I've noticed. Yeah, I know. I mean, there's other kind of genres, people. Sheesh! Yeah, I... I never watch the halftime show because usually it's kind of garbage. Well, hell, one time Beyonce was on and the dadgum power went out right after that. I remember hearing about that, yeah. Like, yeah, like, even like Beyonce and stuff, I have no interest in that at all. I mean, I knew something was up because I could just hear this... Huh? And I'm like, oh, yeah, shit. I heard about it. I think I usually, if I do bother to watch the game, usually when halftime comes, I usually do something else. Well, I was listening to it, and all you hear, Jesse, is this. Zzz. I'm like, mm -hmm. something's not right there. Something's yeah. wrong. With and all of a sudden, it just died. I mean, it just went off, and I thought, uh oh, something ain't right here. And then all of a sudden, they called back oh. and they get the broadcast back up, but they're using their phone because the power was out. Huh? So they were doing it on their fucking cell phones. Nice. Yeah. Get away from me! Ugh. Oh. It's tricky. It took them a little while to get the power back on, but they did. They made yep. it to get it back on. Because so half by, of the stadium was dark. By tricky, I mean I suck. I would need an I suck mode. Well, I'm getting there. Like I said, I was doing okay the first few levels, but I mean, and it's it's not like I don't know what to do. Like it's clearly obvious what I'm supposed to do. But knowing and doing are two completely different things. I'll do a couple more of these. We'll look at a, like I said, we'll just kind of look at what levels I have unlocked and kind of this will just be my HyperDot stream here for this weekend. Uh, that's probably wasn't a good idea to go back in that area. I thought there was going to be a thing that would spawn, but I was wrong. So yeah, we got little power-up things and in addition to the stuff that we're supposed to collect and I really wish you would just quit spawning right in the middle of the lines he said sorry you had to watch she wolf videos and I'm back now what Steve talking about poppy uh, halftime shows Oh, okay. I was like, huh? Who knows about Steve? He's weird. Oh, god dang it. Alright, a couple more times, then we'll... Check out other modes, or what? I don't know what I'll do. We'll, like, so we'll see a couple levels, and... Because we're almost to the point where we've... I can play all the levels I've unlocked so far. I don't know what I have to do to unlock G. I think I only have one more set, at least in this type of thing to unlock. Uh, yeah, let's, okay, this will be my last attempt, and then we'll, uh, we'll see what happens. Zay, hi, how you doing? Okay, if you guys could just triangle your asses away from me, that would be great. Uh, okay, hit that. Yowzers. Okay, well, all right, well, that's what that is. So, yeah, we still have... Actually, we're on F. Yeah, so G is still locked. Survival. Oh, God, it's another ice level. Ugh. And 
and I didn't look to how far. Oh god, yeah, I don't even think I have the energy for this. You just watch and there's just this cascade of... Heh, <laughs> you only have to last 13 seconds. Which should tell you something. It's like, oh yeah, if you can only even last this long, you're doing really well. Wow. Well, I can at least say I got fairly far. <laughs> Alright, well, let's see what else we got here. Another survival. It's a dark level. Okay, you're sneaking in. Oh. Oh, we got like super hexagon going on here. Mm -hmm. Except it's circles. That's got some catchy pixel music, man. Or, uh, chiptune music. And that game is one that'll definitely make you angry. You're lucky if you last like eight seconds on that one. Makes you madder than Hyphen did? Well, Hyphen, at least I got a couple levels mm -hmm. in. I like the music in Super Hexagon a lot. Yee. Oh, so that one it shoots you forward, so you really gotta book it. Okay. And this one almost seems like it's like a fixed pattern, so this one almost seems like it's like you memorize. Hi, how you doing? Wow. 30 seconds? Oh, gabah. F that nonsense. Uh-uh. Okay, whoa. Okay, it seeks in at you and then it chases you. Okay, this looks lovely. Ha <laughs> ha Okay, I don't... Okay. This one is... Yikes! Okay, how long am I supposed to survive here? 15 seconds. This one... Seems the most doable out of all of them in this category so far. This one at least looks like I have a semi a bit of a prayer. Oh, until I do something stupid like that and walk into the one shape that's in that area of the screen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And my battery's at 10%. Nice. Cool. Yeah, we'll wrap it up here pretty soon. We're almost done with the... Uh... I thought I had more time than that. Uh, we're almost there. Hell yeah! I can beat... I say I beat one of them. And... Oh god, it's another area one. Okay, what is this gimmick? Other than me dying right away. Okay, so these do like little start-stop. These are weird little shapes that... Okay, I see what their gimmick is. Alright, let's see what other level we got. Here we go. Okay, that's the final level we have. I only beat one in F. So let's go really quick and let's just see what... See, so custom levels... Uh, let's see if... Custom, no custom levels found. And that, that would be a thing. Okay, well, so it looks like you can't, maybe they'll add it in later, but like there's no like a Steam sharing thing or something where you can look at other people's levels. Maybe it's just ones that you create. Let's see what free play is really fast before we... Okay, so we got classic, slate, try, burst, divide, Assortment and lateral gridlock swarm. Okay, so these are basically just your and then random. So let's just do random. Oh, of course, you're gonna give me an L oh, area on an ice. Really, guys? That's what you're gonna do? You're gonna give me. Uh-huh. Alright, let's just do... Let's just see what Classic is really fast. Yep, 
So now we got our regular shapes. And if I die, like I just did, okay, so it just gives me a time thing. Survival. So yeah, okay, so it's just basically like a survive as long as you can. Probably get like a high time record or something. Uh, but you know, you have different patterns that you can choose, different, you know, you got your, uh, you know, your different areas and ice and all that kind of stuff. So uh, yeah, I mean, look at this. So you go cancel or leave. Look at how nice and large that text is. I mean, to some people that would seem just extremely large, but for me, that's fantastic. I love it. I think that's where we're going to wrap it up though, because uh, we've been playing for a little while, but that's some hyper dot. It is out on the Xbox One as well as Steam, so you want to pick it up, I would say go for it. Kind of a neat little action-y puzzle game. Uh, I did okay, but oh boy, where I'm at now, I'm kind of to the point where uh, not so much. Uh, I don't know how many more levels I'm actually going to be able to beat, but I got still some good enjoyment out of it. I will come back to it uh, from time to time, try to see if I can do any better. And again, shout out to the developer for making uh, making the game with some accessibility features. The dark mode is ex especially appreciated. Nice work, Charles. The large text, again, really nice. Love it. Um, a lot of different ways to play, a lot of different control methods. And all you really need to do is if you have the capacity, if you have the capability to move a cursor, be it with a mouse, a head tracking, controller, keyboard, whatever, you know, all you got to do is move it around. That's the only mechanic. So, you know, it's, it's a very challenging game, but if you're able to do that, uh, if you have like a motor impairment or something, it's still playable. So we'll wrap it up here. Follow me on Twitter at BGFH79, Mixer.com slash BGFH, and of course, IllegallyCited.com and YouTube.com slash IllegallyCited. Uh, if this, hopefully we'll get this archived and probably get this for tomorrow's Mixer Stream archive. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for everybody for stopping in. Got a good crowd today. And until next time, we'll chat with you guys later. Bye, everyone.